Hungry, angry, lonely, tired, hold. These are the signs of emotional distress. Activate your mind. Emotional distress means that you are feeling something very strongly and it's making you act and react in ways that may not be good for you. We are humans and not robots and we have physiological and emotional needs uh, that are important for us to help us live healthy and beneficial lives. Hungry. Well, that can be pretty straightforward. It might be the case that you haven't eaten a lot because you have been very busy working or doing other things. Or it might be the case that you're not eating because you're trying to lose some weight. But feeling hungry can lead to feelings of anger. And everybody is acquainted with this uh, feeling of anger where now you feel annoyed and, and snappy because you are hungry and it's not because somebody did something to you it's just your body is low on sugar and is trying to uh, tell you that it's time to eat nobody can make you angry uh, even if somebody yells at you or screams at you or if you feel like somebody has treated you uh, unfairly Anger is something that is self-generated and lives within you. Only you can make yourself angry by reacting to whatever it is that happened out there. So if you're feeling angry, just think about the reasons for why you're feeling angry and whether um, it is reasonable for you to be so upset about a situation, whether you have control over it or or don't because if you don't have control over what happened to you and you're feeling angry that's really not helping you to uh, achieve anything if you can do something about it great but if you can't there's just no point in being angry you might feel lonely at times and even when you're surrounded by people you might still feel a lack of connection and we are uh, social creatures. We like to be with others. We like to feel part of a group, and for the most part, you know, you li uh, we like to feel accepted by others. Um, and feeling lonely is not a great feeling. It can lead to um, feelings of sadness and depression. So you really have to watch out for for feelings of loneliness. So if you are feeling lonely, uh, make an effort to reach out to others. Uh, there's always somebody out there that can uh, help you and that can talk to you and even people who you don't know might be willing to just spend a little time talking to you. So don't shortchange yourself and feel that if there's nobody there uh, uh, to, to engage with uh, that you, you can't or shouldn't, you should try and seek opportunities to talk to people and to feel that you're part of something uh, um, else. And tired. Tiredness, it is a chronic situation in our modern society because we are always hearing messages about working hard and go, go, go and doing all of these things that are uh, important to help us achieve our goals and be productive. But I would argue that that has led to an epidemic of tired people out there. And being tired is not good for anybody because tiredness can lead to high levels of uh, stress. And many times uh, people can engage in behaviors that are not good in trying to relieve some of the stress, such as excessive drinking or using drugs or engaging in other behaviors that can be really, really harmful to you. So if you find yourself chronically tired, if you're always tired, there is something that needs to change because being tired doesn't help you in the long run and it doesn't help anybody and actually can be very, very harmful. So understanding your body, understanding what you're going through is very important so you can help yourself and you can start doing some things to change those situations. So remember the acronym? halt hungry angry lonely tired and keep these things in mind throughout the day so if you're experiencing any of these situations then you can do something about it to change them before it gets 
uh, too much and it gets you into some trouble. All right, so if you like this video, please subscribe and like us and leave a comment and let me know what you think if you like any of the stuff that you heard today. All right, well, enjoy your day and I'll see you in the next video.